Hey, hey, good morning, everyone. Welcome to the Reading Nook. Come on, sit down, bring your stuffies with you, and let's get ready for some stories and some singing. Kenny, are you ready for some singing? Yeah. What do you think? Yeah? yeah? All right. Well, before we get started, I just wanted to say hi to a couple of friends. I wanted to say hi to Lauren and Julia and Tegan, Adara, uh, Jing Tong, Sky, Alyssa, Haley, Austin, and Stella. Hi, guys. How's it going? I hope you guys are enjoying our songs and our books. All right, let's get ready with our first song. Are you going to sing, Kenny? <gasps> oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind the trees. These little children are asking me to please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. There we go. Oh, that was a good note at the end there, Kendall. Good job. All right, you know what? I think we're going to sing a special song en français today for our friend Madame Sophie because I know that she loves when I sing in French. Should we do that? All right, you ready? All right, here we go. Il y a un rat dans le grenier, j'entends le chat qui miaure. Il y a un rat dans le grenier, j'entends le chat miaurer. J'entends, j'entends, j'entends le chat qui miaure. J'entends, j'entends, j'entends le chat miaurer. Il y a un rat dans le grenier, j'entends le chat qui miaure. Il y a un rat dans le grenier, j'entends le chat miaurer. J'entends, j'entends, j'entends le chat qui miaure. J'entends, j'entends, j'entends le chat miaurer. There we go. Did you like that one? I like that one. That's a silly one. All right, so you guys ready? Let's get ready for our first, first book. Remember, please like and share this video. I've set up an event for Friday. I want to have as many people as possible come on Friday. So please like and share. And here we go. We're going to go for our first book. It's called A Big Guy Took My Ball. All right, so here we go. A big guy took my ball. Gerald! Woo! I found a big ball, and it was so fun. Oh my goodness, these pages. And then a big guy came, and, and, and he took my ball. Whoa. I am so upset. Oh. <laughs> that is not good. That is not right. Big guys have all the fun. What about the little guys? What makes those big guys think they are so big? Their size? Mm. Well, I am big too. I will get your ball from that big guy. My hero. Here I go. Let's see how big this big guy is. Ooh! Hmm. Did you get my ball back? That is a big guy. You did not say how big he was. He is very Big! He is bigger than I am. Much bigger. I am smaller than he is. Much smaller. He is so biggy, big, big. Gerald, you did not get my ball back, did you? Hmm. I did not. Why? Excuse me. Thank you for finding my little ball. 
that is not your ball, and you think it is little? Well, I am big. So big that no one will play with me. Little guys have all the fun. Um, big guy, would you like to play whale ball with us? What is whale ball? Well, we, we don't know. We haven't made it up yet. With a little help, we can all have big fun. Huge fun. The end. There we go. Oh, did you like that one? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Should we sing another song? All right. Should we sing uh, Aiken Drum? Yeah. All right. You guys ready? All right. There was a man lived in the moon, in the moon, in the moon. There was a man lived in the moon, and his name was Aiken Drum. And he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. He played upon a ladle. And his name was Aiken Drum. And his hair was made of spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti. His hair was made of spaghetti, and his name was Aiken Drum. And his eyes were made of meat balls, meat balls, meat balls. His eyes were made of meat balls, and his name was Aiken Drum. Clap along, and he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. Played upon a ladle, and his name was Aiken Drum. And his nose was made of, do you remember what it is? His nose was made of cheese, cheese, cheese. cheese. His nose was made of cheese, and his name was Aiken Drum. And his mouth was made of pizza, pizza, pizza. His mouth was made of pizza, and his name was Aiken Drum. And he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. He played upon a ladle, and his name was Aiken Drum. There was a man lived in the moon, in the moon, in the moon. There was a man lived in the moon, and his name was Aiken Drum. Mm. Thank you, Kendall. Thank you so much, guys. Keep singing along. All right, so our last book for today is a very colorful book that is called The Book Hog. All right, ooh, look at this cool page, all those polka dots. All right, here we go. The book hog loved books. And he had quite a few. Yeah, that's the watermelon seed book. Do you want to have a seed, Kendall? There we go. Yeah, you have that one. He loved the way they smelled. Ah, and he loved the way the pages felt in his hooves. He especially liked the ones with pictures. He picked them up here and there and anywhere he could find them. But the book hog had a secret. Shh, a big secret. He didn't know how to read. He had never learned. He was surrounded by books, but the book hog couldn't read a single one. The book hog went to bed every night without a bedtime story. One morning, he went out looking for more books. He came to a long, low building. He smelled some books inside. He snuck through the stacks, adding several books to his pile, but then a soft voice said, Would you like to come join us for story time? It was Miss Olive, the librarian. Pick out a book, and I'll read it with you. The book hog blinked, then he swallowed. You'll read a book with me? Of course, said Miss Olive. As many as you'd like. This gave the book hog an idea. Wait here, he said. He went home. And he came back, oh my goodness, with some books. Why is the ball 
Aww. He listened to all kinds of books. Miss Olive led story time, and the book hog listened closely. Have a seat, Kendall. He heard many stories, some funny, some sad, some kind of in between. Over time, and with practice, the book hog learned to read on his own. He grew to love books even more, not just for the way they looked and felt, but for the stories that they told. And yes, the book hog still takes lots of books, but he always brings them back. Book fair this Wednesday. The end. Did you like that one? I really like that one too. All right, did you guys like that one at home? I hope you did. All right, should we sing our goodbye song? What do you think? The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause my friends are your friends and your friends are my friends. The more we get together, the happier be. Oh, the more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. With Kendall and Jack and Blake and Leo, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. All right. Thank you so much for coming, everybody. I will see you all tomorrow. I love you all very much. Have a great day. Remember, please like and share, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Bye. Ken, are you going to say goodbye? Bye. Bye.